Vincent Stahl, and I'm doing a weekly dog training series for Lost Pet Reporter. And last week we went over uh, possessive behavior with dogs, how to take a bone away safely. Um, this is something that you might encounter when you just bring a dog home, you discover that they're possessive and they have a toy and now you're in a situation that you need to get it away. Uh, so last week's training would be essential for something like that, that um, you'd be able to take the dog toy away safely. Um, this week we're going to go more into detail. We're going to actually show how, um, how, to, how to train the dogs not to um, be possessive and we're going to show them that that behavior is not acceptable and we're going to show them what acceptable behavior that we want out of them. So Sam's possessive of this fur. And to take it away from him without getting bit is taking a chance. So if it's just me and Sam, he's not as possessive. But if you introduce another dog, like I have my shepherd to the right here, it becomes more possessive and becomes more challenging to get the, the ball away from him. Now we gotta leave it. You gonna leave it? You want that? You gotta leave it. No, 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 that's not acceptable, no, 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 so he's not going to get a reward until he does what I ask him to do. And this could take some time, it takes some patience. Yes. What was that? So, he didn't do exactly what I wanted, but I'm showing him now that we have some, some rewards for him, and he's gonna become interested in these rewards. And the idea is to get him more interested in the reward that you have than the toy that he's being possessive of. So, right now he's leaving it. Yes. Leave it. Do you want this? Mm -hmm. Do you want this? Can I have the football? So, again, you see I have the leash here so that if he decides he's going to lunge at you, it's for safety that you have that, that um, there to prevent that from happening. No. 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 So sometimes what works is simply looking away from him, not giving him attention. Rather than having a staring contest and show the dominance, just look away. And then that should de-escalate the, the aggressiveness. Like that, you gotta give me the ball. Yes, yes, very good. Now he did what I wanted him to do and they have something called jackpotting. And basically you just give him a lot of treats. Yes, yes. Yes, very good. Now I give him the ball. Now I'm gonna want him to, gonna ask him to leave it again. Can you give me the football? You gonna let it go? Give me the ball. Give me the ball. The other thing you wanna do is when you reward him, use different hands. Don't always use the same hand. Can I have the ball? Give me the ball. Yes. Yes. That was very good. So we give him another reward. So he hesitated there, and that's showing me that this ball is more valuable than the treats that I'm giving him. So now it's time to step it up a little bit. So we'll go ahead and give him the ball. So here we have a different reward for him. We'll see if this is more valuable than what I was using. So I'm gonna tell Sam I'm gonna take his toy. I'm gonna leave it. Hmm? You gotta leave it. Yeah, so I would give him that and take his ball. Yes! Yes! Very good boy. I'll give him another treat. I'm gonna jackpot him. Very good boy. Yes. Now I'll give him the ball. There you go. He really likes that ball. And now I'm gonna ask him to leave it again. Now this is just a repetition. You're gonna keep doing this 
until it finally sinks in that what he wants you to do is leave the ball and that's the appropriate behavior and that by being possessive is inappropriate behavior. Yes. 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 And we're jackpotting him because that was very good. Yes. Yes. Now I'm going to give him the ball. Well, you got the ball there. And by giving him the ball all the time is also showing him that I'm not taking the ball away and I'm not going to let him have it. So he's not being punished. He's getting the ball, and that's what he wants. But he's learning that the importance is that he's not to be possessive. He is to release the ball when I ask him to. So you want that? There you go. Yes. Yes. Very good. Yes. I give him the ball. Yes. So now he's more interested in these treats than the other treats I was using. So you can see the importance of finding what is of more value to the dog than, uh, than what the toy or you know whatever he has at, at the moment. So, yes, very good. So you just continue doing this until you can take the ball away. And you may want to do this one or two minutes, five minutes a day. Um, or you may want to do it several times a day, but try not to exceed two minutes. Um, their, their attention span isn't as long as, as uh, humans, and they become bored. And so it's better to just do it more often and less time, and they'll learn what you want them to do. That's it for now. Hope you enjoyed the video, and please like or subscribe to our YouTube channel.